Nicky Hill is outside the London Stadium, West Ham fan TV, troops, Yo. Arsenal fan TV, Yo. superstar. <laughs> <laughs> Back right again. Guy. Back again. Um, right guy, you know. A tough result for you to take, I think, and um, a, a one we're really delighted with. But a couple of questions quickly about West Ham. What did you make of West Ham tonight? I think you had a lot of heart, fam. You understand? I think you had a lot of heart, a lot of desire. I think you, you, you lot were pressing, blood. You understand? You started early as well. And the fans, like, I don't know what your fans fan, you understand? It's a bit iffy, blood, because sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down, sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down. But I think when Moyes come in, I was a bit, hmm, because it's Moyes, isn't it? But when you look at it, when he's at like this kind of level of the club, West Ham, Everton, he's a good manager. Yeah. And I think he'll do well for you lot. But I think you can see that he's you lot look defensively better. I'll tell you what, he's got the defence organised like no one's business. Shout out Chelsea, then shout out Arsenal. Was unlucky Lucky against, against City. City. Um kind of Arsenal, mate. What do you think of Arsenal? Arsenal's chances now. He seem to be blowing points left, right and centre. Fam, I swear down, blood, these men are blowing points like I'm blowing weed, fam. You get me? It's just all over the gaff, blood. And this top this top top four is looking more and more difficult. Because Tottenham scumbags won today, obviously Liverpool drew, but I can't really see this getting any better because I think we need a lot in in, in the window in January. But you know Wenger fam, he's not gonna spend the money, you understand? Apparently Onzonzi's done. But we need more than Onzonzi blood. Because yeah. we need a we, we need a man that can sit in the midfield and we need a man that can actually create blood. Because I love Jack here yeah? and I think he needs a chance. But I think we need more than Jack Blood, you understand? Because yeah. we're missing Santi a lot, fam. And you're starting to see it now, blood, because there's no link from the midfield to the attack. Mm. You understand? And then you got fucking Giroud up top, they fright they're, they're lumping the ball at him, you can't even control the ball, can't even hold up the play. Yeah. I don't know why he started, blood. For me, he's a good impact player. You bring him on when they're 20 minutes to go and then you lump it in. You, you, you start like a blood clot set to tire the defence, to run him yeah. about, he's got pace, he'll run him behind you. You don't understand? I said to Robbie, look, on, in our preview that we done the other day, I said, look, I, I would start Lacazette because Giroud, he played all right, but he didn't get no, he got no change from our defenders. And when we done that against Morata, I said the pace would, yeah. would might catch us out. And, and he's giving five minutes at the end. That's crazy, isn't it? It's crazy, blood. You buy a 50 million pound striker and then you bring him on in the 85th minute, blood. You understand? And he, like I said, he's never completed the game. He's never completed the whole 90 minutes, blood. You understand? And it's, I don't know what the, I don't know what was the point buying him, blood. Because if you're not going to use him, if you're not going to utilize him, you understand? I'm having a lot of arguments with Man United fans saying that I, I personally think. Like a blood clot set is ten times the player Lukaku is, man. You understand? Look, 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 Lukaku's shit, fam. You understand? All his goals are in the 85th minute when it's 3 0. You understand? And then the game's dead. Like I said, he's scoring crucial goals, blood. You understand? He's scoring the first goal or the goal like the equalizer or like to, like, if we're 2 0 down, you get the 2 1 to get you back in the game. You understand? But you can't really, you can't really justify that because everyone's saying, oh, like Lukaku's got more goals. It's like as his first season, fam. You understand? When you check his goal record, when you check his goal record, it's decent for his first season. You understand? But I feel sorry for him, blood, because he has to start. You dominated the game today. Um, but in in well, you in, had the in hindsight, well, I don't know. I, do you know what I was I was saying that? But then when I fought back, you had the Wilshire shot that went over the yep. bar. You hit the post. Yep. Giroud. You know, Giroud had a, had, a, had a good chance, one from the free kick. Yeah. So I thought we both had the chances to win the game. We hit the bar in the 89th. Yeah, the fucking and um, on, re, on on reflection, do you think it's a fair result? I think it is a fair result because yeah. I don't think we did enough to win the game. I don't think you did enough to win the game. So I think a point is a fair result. I think the point's better for you lot. Of course, yeah, we'll take that all day. Yeah, and obviously, like how you played City, Chelsea and us, I think you lot getting four points out of the, out of the nine, you would have took that any day of the week, understand? And for, for us though, I don't know, man, you got to pray for Arsenal, man, you hear me? Quick word for the next week, cup game. Um, you got to tee. Shout out my boy Declan Rice. Yes, That's my boy still. Yes, Shout out my boy, yeah. you get me? That's my boy, blood. I told you, come Arsenal, you and hold him, blood. You get me? But yeah, <laughs> no, I think no, no, he's going to stay here, I yeah, think. I um, yeah, so <laughs> next week, next week um, we play each other in the cup. Yeah. You're going to see two different sides. What, what, what sort of game are we going to be looking at there? I don't know, man. Depends how we start, blood, you understand? Because if you... If you perform in, if you performed how you performed against Tottenham in the second half, we, we're fucked. You understand? We're fucked because we're going to make a lot of changes. We'll probably put out the Europa League team. The defence looks shaky still as well. Mad shaky, fam. Yeah. You understand? Mad shaky. The only, the only blessing is the Bushi will probably come in. Yeah. And he's done well since he's come back. You understand? For me, I think I think Bellerin should be dropped, and I'll put the Bushi in. Yeah. But next week, I'm looking forward to it. One game away from the semi-final. It's so a good see. game, man. Yeah, man. Always a good game. It? It's always a game. Good game. Let's yeah. have some fucking goals, isn't it? Cheers, troops. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, bro. I know, my bro, man. Appreciate it. Always.